Good morning guys from Renong here in southern Thailand, one of the rainiest places in all of Thailand. Today we're heading off out on a motorbike mission to explore Renong province, but before we do that I'm just going to give you a quick hotel tour because this place is so nice and the guy is so kind. So here we are, room 201. You can you hear those dogs? I'm going to show you them in a minute. So straight away as you come in, we've got this strange ladder, we've got a wardrobe area, and the good thing about this room is there's just loads of storage space, can you see? And here as well, like loads of places to put your things. What are them dogs up to? Bathroom. Actually quite nice. Hot water, not that you would need it at this time of the year in Thailand. Really nice, big, comfy bed. Loads of pillows. That is what you want. Little seating area with a view. Fridge. Balcony. Now this is really nice because in the morning it's so peaceful and cool. You can see everyone comes out and does the exercise in this park. You can see everyone running, walking. We've got a little Muay Thai camp. We've got a swimming pool which I think is like 30 baht. We'll definitely be using that. And it's really nice. This room is 600 baht a night. Which yeah is a lot more than we actually usually spend. But after our traumatic experience the other day, we're treating ourselves. We've got PTSD. He also has rooms for 400 baht, which are just as nice, but yeah, like I said, we're treating ourselves. Now, I will take you down to see these doggos. Right, here they are. There are six of these. These are the puppies. They're not the hotel's puppies. They're just random puppies that live around the corner. They're just, they're just constantly here. And they're absolute nuisance. Some of them are really nice. Like, I really like this one. This one's really cute. Oh look, it just tries to like, oh, oh it's climbed onto my knee. Oh, that's so cute, look at this. Oh. This dog, I love this dog. Oh, it's biting me now. They're all in a proper playful mood. But yeah, there's six of them. And they're just right characters, they're proper funny. Here's the hotel, you can see it's really nice, really nice hotel. If you are in Ranong, you should seriously stay here. Like I said, 400 and 600 baht a night, cracking price for a room. We're in a really good location, loads of good food. Scooter rental, 200 baht. We're taking one of them today. Across the road, pretty much, 10 minutes down the road, is the hot springs here in Ranong, so you couldn't be in a better location. So here is the steed. Sawadikab. Here she is for the day. She's nice, isn't she? Nice and blue. So yeah, we're gonna head off on a bit of a Ranong adventure. Let's go. So I think we've come to a little breakfast buffet spot which is literally two doors down from our hotel and I think I think it's like a canon jean and curry spot. What have we got? Yes yeah, so we got different curries, right? That's like a green curry, I don't know what it is. Oh that looks interesting. What's that one? Oh, that looks really good. Let's get a plate. Right guys, this place actually looks really cool. The people are really nice. We've just got a couple of big plates of Canon Jean noodles with curry on. I've got like a yellow curry and another miscellaneous curry. I can't remember what he said. Some of those nice dried chilies, pickled mustard green, bean sprouts, carrot, cucumber. And yeah, obviously the Canon Jean noodles. Really nice place to eat as well, look. Let's just give these curries a try. And it's an all you can eat buffet and it's 60 baht, I think, 59 baht. That's delicious. Spicy. Mm. Instant kick. Oh, that is hot. I love that. Mm. And this darker curry is almost like sweet and peanutty. Really interesting. Sweet, super spicy. So I'll eat this. And then I'll head back because I'm going to try a different curry. Uh, Geng Tai Pa. You'll see. Honestly, really good. And then we've got the dried chilies. Mm. Yes, yeah, so you can just keep going back and getting as many plates as you want. Obviously, you can't have like 50 plates, but you get the point. Now, I've just put a little bit of this on my plate. This is Geng Tai Pa, which is, I believe, a fish innards curry, which I've never tried before. It does smell quite strong. You see there's some chilies in there. I say let's just go for it. Cheers. Mmm. 
very strong taste. A bit, hmm, a bit strange. Very strong, a bit of a stinky taste. Hmm. Not bad, not my favourite. I'll eat it, but probably won't make my top three dishes. And as well, I just need to show you this, we also get this soup included, and it's just full of pork liver, pieces of pork, intestine, blood cake, pork balls. This is a ridiculous value for money. So yeah, let's get a couple more plates of these, then we'll head off. Right guys, we are on our way out of Ranong City right now, and as soon as you leave the city, it's so green, there's just jungle everywhere. We've got a temple here and a big Buddha, big golden Buddha. And there's pretty much no traffic on this highway, it's so good. Like, pretty much non-existent. It's under construction, but yeah, a big temple. But in the distance, it's just green, just green jungle. So we'll keep going. We'll try and find some nice spots. Yeah, like, check out these views pretty much as you leave Ranong. It's just beautiful green jungle, it's so nice. This highway is so nice as well, I can't get over it. There's just no one here, just us, and then just these jungle views. Look at that little river, river, lake. Wow. Not a bad place to go for a bit of a bike ride, is it? How do you feel, Leash? I'm feeling excited. We've got some really nice spots to go to. It's going to be beautiful. So this is a really nice highway. We've never actually been on a highway like this in Thailand before. Because the road is just like dead. And they're surrounding this beautiful jungle with loads of palm trees. The occasional really nice. truck, yeah. but that's very rare. Well, let's just wait until this bloody massive bus is gone so we don't get absolutely <laughs> side -flies. We get to do the classic, classic time manoeuvre of driving down the hard shoulder on the wrong side. So we're nipping too. This little coffee shop we just saw on the map that just looks really cool, it's like in the jungle. Hopefully it'll be really nice. We've not had a coffee yet, so it should perk us up. And is it here? Oh, yeah, it's here. Sawadee Ah. After the top, you can take a bike over there. Okay, okay, super, yeah. super. <laughs> oh, it's friendly cat. What is your cat's name? Cow Niu Deng. Cow? It's a Thai name. Cow Niu Deng. Cow Niu Deng. Yeah, Cow Niu Deng. You know Cow Niao, right? Cow Niao, sticky rice? Yes, yes. sticky rice. Hello! <laughs> He's quite old. Oh, it's, like it's a big, big cat. Years, 11. Years Friendly, aren't you? Oh, what are these? Uh, any any other I have? And then, uh, pickled lemon. Uh, pickled lemon. lemon? Yeah, it's ah, a lime. A lime. Pickled ah, lemon. Really, super interesting. We bring it to, 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 to make a syrup. Oh, coffee. cool, the syrup, syrup. Yeah, and we drink it with the soda. Ah, it's Very delicious. Very popular here. Oh, ah, okay. Maybe we'll try. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's have a look. Right, so we just pulled up at this coffee shop. Just at the side of the highway. It's pretty much in the jungle. Let's go and take a walk around. It looks so nice, doesn't it? Ah, yes. We have a look. We'll have a look. Ah, okay. Pop, pom, pom, chu, Ellis. Ah, Ellis. Ellis. Chai. We'll have a look. Yeah, so this just looks like another absolute classic, classic Thai coffee shop. It's on the river again. I'm telling you, I could never get bored of these coffee shops on the river. Let's just, just take a look what's going on. So this is really interesting. It's really rustic. It's really nice. You can hear the birds. It's, it's like proper in the jungle. We've got some cocks over there, some roosters. In typical, true Thai fashion, we've got a bar that you can sit in and drink your coffee. Again, you've just got to love the Thai coffee shops. Sometimes they're, just, they're actually laughable. There's actually chairs in there that you can sit on and drink your coffee. Again here on the little waterfall. I'm guessing you can go for swimming here as well. The water looks really clear and nice. And then there's also a, there's hammocks under the bridge. 
to sit in the shade. These little hammocks. If the coffee's good here, I'll put the place in the description. Just off the highway, yeah, this is a really nice seating area. Deck chairs up here to sit on. And the jungle trees are shading us, so like it's a nice refuge from the heat. How nice is this? Hey, I don't know about that though. Should I throw that in the river, get rid of it? And then there's more chairs, we'll, we'll get a coffee and we'll, we'll take a look down there, probably sit in the river. Ah, ah. Th th Dini Soy, Mark. Dini, Dini, Mimi, Mimi Hank. My, my me? My me hang. Ah. Okay, okay, okay. That's the other one. It's the other one. That's the other one. Wow, the river goes all the way down there. It's so nice. Right, let's get a coffee. What's this you found, Leash? It smells like Vicks, but like natural. You need that. That's serious stuff. That, that'll clear that? your airway, no matter what. It's like got peppercorns in it and things. This is the coffee shop and it smells so good. Yeah, dumb. <laughs> What's it for? For like health? It must be, yeah, like those yeah, nasal inhalers that they sniff. It does smell well, it doesn't it? Like... It can't get too. Yeah, it's got a strange, strange um, scent on it. Oh, a leaf. Yeah. I need aloe. Ah, you can, you can stir fry it. Pat. Aloe. Ah, chai, chai, pat, pat. Wow, super interesting. I need coffee. Cafe? Ah, some cafe. Tinai? Getting a bit of a little coffee shop tour, okay? These plants? Ah, some cafe. Oh, yeah, just by the side of the road. Coffee coffee plants. Yeah, we make cafe. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We make cafe. Ah, super interesting. Yeah, me. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, cafe, yeah. cafe, cafe. Mm, yeah, this is this, this. Yes, 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 yes. Ranong mm. Cafe. Mm. Ah. Cafe, they call it Cafe Sot. Cafe Sot. Mm. Ah, okay. This is what we eat. Ah, okay, okay. And this is this. Yes, 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 chai. Ah, uh, cup and cup. It gets you wired. And this, 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 this is what we eat. Ah, Kang Tao. Kang Tao? Yes, Kang Tao. Bop, bop, bop. I'm lost on that one. Is he saying something about the roosters over there? Mm. The leaf. Ah, oh, okay. Any, any, any guy? Guy, yeah. Any, any, what's that? Butum. Butum. Any, 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 น้ำจิ้งอ่าอันนี้กินกับน้ำจิ้งเห็นมั้ยเป็นยาอ่าเวลาเรากินอ่ะเป็นยาอู้สบายสามีนี่สกุลฟิสต์มาก่อนเป็
This is no UK motorway service station, is it? This is next level. Look at it. This is crazy nice, and the people are all absolutely lovely. It's just a running theme here in Ranong, the people are just amazing. Did the fish get you? How much? It's like so tickly, isn't it? Well, yeah, once they find you, that's it, that's it, they're coming for your feet. Right guys, as soon as I turn the camera off, so many fish have just swarmed my feet. I don't know if you can see them, they're all over my toes, and the bigger boys have come out, and they're all just proper, having a good old nibble. Oh, it's so funny. It's like a proper little massage. This is heaven, this. Oh, it's a bit of a strange combination, actually. I sat here on a swing, drinking a fresh Americano, whilst fish are nibbling my feet. What a strange... What are we doing here? Oh, it's heaven. This is heaven. I love it. The one downside to this jungle cafe, these bad boys, Leash just caught this massive moz feasting on our Look at that with the black and white specks. The biggest one I've ever seen in the Horrible little critters, aren't they? Is he going to take a runner from me? So what do you have? What do you have? There he goes. Yeah, what a little spot. The owners are so nice. Just spot the owner. All the coffee is literally grown in the hills behind us up in the jungle. All roasted here. It just doesn't get any better. So what we're going to do is carry on heading down here and just see if we can find anything else interesting for you. We're just kind of just freestyling. So let's see. Let's go. Back on the beast. Let's do it. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Really hello, my friend. You're cute, I like this. You're stylish. <laughs> Looking good. good We've got to go now, mate. Yeah. We're going. Oh, what's that? What have you come over for? Is this a please touch me again? Yes. Yeah, I'm Super cute. Oh. My name is I'm the way. I'm the way. I'm the way. My name is Tony Dang. Tony Dang. Sticky red sticky ride. Tony Dang. Tony Dang. Red sticky ride. Are there? Animal oh. whisperer. Are there? It's a big fat cat. It is big. You like, you like. Are there? What's it? Huh? Kunchu alaika. Kunchu alaika. Go deck, go deck. Go deck. Ah, okay. Jack, Jack, Jack. Jack, Jack. Jack, Jack. 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 I'm no way. Can you dance? Can you dance? Really nice little spot. Make sure you come here if you're driving fast. Right guys, we're just driving down this absolutely stunning highway. I mean, usually I hate highway driving. In Isan, the highway driving was just horrendous. But here, it's so beautiful. Look at the view. So we've pulled off at this little viewpoint and we've just got this ridiculous jungle view. Look at this. You can actually see the ocean over there. So where we are right now in Ranong, pretty much. We're pretty much next to Myanmar line so close to Burma it's just over there just on the other side of the ocean there the Andaman Sea and yeah this is a this is a really nice little viewpoint really nice the Sun has come out to shine it is absolutely sweltering but we have made it to the Lam Nam Lam Nam Krabori National Park there's a viewpoint we're gonna drive up to very soon but there's also a mangrove walk here, we're going to check it out. Right, so they've built a trail through the mangroves, this beautiful wooden decking. It says it takes half an hour to an hour, so we'll head round. It says there's quite a lot of animals here, like mud lobsters, all kinds of stuff. And yeah, it should be really nice, so let's just go off it. Look at this decking they've built. Proper nice little spot. Ah, so there's loads of wildlife in here. And all the way around, I think they put information signs here. There are some mud skippers, and you definitely can't see it on the camera, but we've actually spotted a few. There's a few just like loitering around in the mud. You can see one there, you definitely can't see it. Its eyes are just like peeking out of the water. But yeah, this is really cool so far. It's like a proper little mangrove walk. I mean, it's funny though, because you could just fall off the edge. You've got to be a bit careful. Keep your eyes where you're walking. But let's be quiet and see if we can spot anything. So there's lots of mud crabs as well. You can see all these holes in the mud. Really? 
Can you see them? There's a red one there. And a red one. Oh, yes, loads of crabs. But as soon as you go like anywhere near, they just they just disappear. Plus, they're everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, the camera's never going to do this justice. This is a place you need to come for yourself to understand. It's definitely an absolute mosquito fest in here, though. I don't even want to know how many there are. And then here we have the elusive mud lobster. I've never seen one of these in my entire life. I'll keep my eyes peeled for that. It looks like a scorpion. What a cool animal. Again, if I spot one, you've never seen it on this camera, but we'll keep our eyes peeled. There must be a lot of them. Let's just keep walking around. I mean, what a beautiful path. We're the only people here in this national park area. Absolutely stunning. I think Ranong is one of the like, least travelled provinces in Thailand and least populated provinces in Thailand. It's also the rainiest province, like I said before. One of. Ranong and Trat, both super rainy. I think they have like an eight month rainy season on the facts today, aren't they? But yeah, so far it's super underrated province. We've been having loads of fun. The, pe the people, again, the people are absolutely amazing. This place is honestly stunning. Like, we just came across this, we had no idea this was here. So we have no expectations, but yeah, it's a really beautiful little mangrove area. I'm wondering, is there any crocs kicking around in here? But yeah, look at the, the views here, it's just like, like in the mangroves. Really, really cool place. Can hear the birds whistling as well, super cool. Look at this viewpoint. Oh wow! That is one of the most beautiful birds I've ever seen flying through. It's like bright, illuminous red and blue and orange. Wow! Can you hear them? Wow, this place is incredible. Oh, I love it here. Yeah, there's so much wildlife in here. This is like an absolute paradise if you're into animals. Bad news, apparently there are crab-eating macaques in here. I do not like monkeys whatsoever. I hope we do not run into any of them. I don't have my shrimp paste on me. That is apparently the secret to keeping them away. Right guys, so in this national park, there's a few little spots, things you can see, there's that mangrove walk. There is also a waterfall over there somewhere. And then there's a viewpoint up, a super steep road, I think, which we're about to head up now. Now for Thai people, it's 20 baht to enter. For foreigners, it's 100. But let's just say, I um, charmed the lady with my very best Thai and English politeness. And the rest was history. Let's head up and not drop my helmet on the floor. Let's go up. I'm going to check out the viewpoint, which Ellis got us a good deal on. <laughs> and we've read that it's super steep. That's how far it's gone out of here. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm expecting it to just turn into like an absolute mountain, but hopefully it won't be too bad. I hate driving up these massive steep hills on a scooter on a little automatic beast. I see. Hopefully we'll be able to get a cracking view into Burma, into Myanmar. Let's see. Oh, it'll be worse though. This is where it begins. Oh God. Let's go for it. It is pretty Oh wow, look behind us. This is going to be an incredible view up here. Wow. It is quite steep. I'm not looking forward to going back down, <laughs> I'll tell you that. Very well now. Woo -hoo -hoo. Yes! Bloody Southern Thailand! Woo -hoo. Woo! Oh! Take rear. Wait, that wasn't even that bad. Whoa, oh, wow! Let's park up and have a look at this. <laughs> that was a genuine reaction right there to this view. <laughs> oh my word. That was incredible. That was pure excitement there. You saw can, the water. Oh, there. you can camp up here. Right, I'll park the bike and then. 
Right guys, we're at the top. This place is incredible. I can't wait to show you this view. I'm just gonna show you this little area here because it says here is a campground. So you can actually stay up here. Now that will be incredible because I bet in the morning, I bet all the clouds come out. I'm gonna show you the view now. It looks like a barbecue area. Let me show you this. I am loving life right now. I'm feeling so happy. This view is stunning, honestly. Wait until you see this. So this is the cow korma viewpoint. Like a chicken korma. Wait until you see this. Wow. And there's no one here. Ranong, the most underrated province in Thailand. Holy whacka moly. This is absolutely stunning. I can't believe it. I actually can't believe it. <laughs> Sound like one of them idiotic YouTubers now. Like, can't believe everything. But this is genuinely incredible. This is shocking. Wow. So that is Myanmar. That is Burma. Literally just across the ocean. The Andaman Sea. And the water looks so blue. It looks incredible. I'd love to get in there. And it's just pure jungle. Pure, pure jungle. Ranong is so green. I think that's due to it being like one of the rainiest provinces in town. So green, so jungly. Wow. You can see all these islands. Burma, oh my. You can tell I'm excited. Such an nice view. This was so worth it. Never even heard of this place. We've just literally rocked up. Wow. I've made a discovery, guys. Check this out. Bloody legendary. <laughs> you rhino with the most incredible view of Myanmar. That is so funny. You can sit here on the toilet with that view. That is so funny. Let's have a do it. Look at that. Does it get much better than that? Is it well funny? People might be able to bloody telescope over in Myanmar watching you do a poo. Well funny. I think this is here for if you're camping, so there's like toilets and showers, but wow, that's so funny. Love Thailand. In case I didn't say it before, I bloody love Thailand, by the way. One last look at the view. There we go. This is my call to you to get out and explore these hidden gems in Thailand. Just head off anywhere, and there's just going to be amazing stuff everywhere. This country is just full of natural beauty. And I've just had the best wee of my entire life on that toilet down there. Unbelievable stuff. Let's head back down the steep hill of death. Oh, it's well steep. It's well daunting. Oh, I don't really feel like it. I have to get down there. It is so steep, it's like well scurry. Look at this. It's like the steepest road I've ever driven on in my entire life. It levels out soon. We're almost there. But look at the views. Like, holy moly, imagine if your brakes failed here. Like, yeah. what the fuck would you do? I mean, sorry about the F bomb there, but. Like, my heart is like 130 BPM right now. Wow, so we've just pulled off the road. There's a geezer who just pulled up the insufficient. Sabadihab. Wow, what a nice place to fish. I'm going to keep it quiet so I don't disrupt this man's fishing session, but. Beautiful place to just come. Like how peaceful is this? Titini soy mag. Soy mag. Oh god. Dog in cow. Ah, okay. Soy, soy. Okay, okay. Ah, okay. We just got to the viewpoint. Whoa. You can see the tale. Kun Mazak Tinai Hap. Ranong. Ah, okay. 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 Uh, Ranong number one. Yes. So beautiful. Wow, guys, what a place. Ben Kon Angit Hap. Angit, Angit, Angit. Wow. Yeah, what a place. Okay, chok di, chok di. Yindi tiraruzak. Wow. 
I just want I just need to show you these places because this is like one of the most peaceful places ever. And you just drive around and you come across like, honestly. It doesn't get better than this, does it? What a spot this guy's found. Right, let's go. Goodbye. Nice guy. Right guys, the day just gets better and better. The ticket we bought at that other national park actually lets you come and look at this waterfall as well. Now this is Namtok Punyaban. And obviously it's dry season right now, so there's hardly any water, but it's still a really beautiful little spot. And you can swim. I think in rainy season you can't swim because I bet obviously being a really rainy province it gets pretty vicious here but yeah so nice we've got a little plunge pool we'll have a look at that but it's ice cold and yeah look at this just literally from the main road Thailand the gift that just keeps on giving eh right guys let's just have a look in here then eh? let's see get the water temperature a bit of a test I'm not gonna go soon because I'm not gonna lie, I can't really get on the back this went through but oh yeah that's refreshing that is nice and cold Oh, that is heaven on a day like this, a sweltering hot day like this. What a place to come. Wow. Nam Tok Punyaban. Absolutely beautiful. Deep as well though, you could get away with like having a little dunk, a little refresh. Could be really nice. On the way out, look at this absolute little sweetheart we found. Come on. With her blue eyes. She is absolutely tiny. What do you want? What do you want? Oh, oh my word. Look at you. You're so small. You're like a rat. It's not very giant. Hi. It's the smallest cat I've seen. Oh, come on then, baby. Oh, you put a little pot belly. Look, it's like a mouse. Oh. What do you have? So small, so small. We just heard it. Meowing, meowing. Because oh. one is that small. I need I need to meow. Chai. Chai. Oh. So small. Meow. The mother abandoned her. Oh. oh. So cute. Does it have a name? Uh, Kao Chu Alaiha. Fifi. 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 <laughs> ah, Fifi. Oh, so it's a little girl. Little Fifi. Oh. I don't think she can see it, can she? Like, no. She's so she's, small. She's like a few days old, I think, or like a week. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. She just wants snugs because I don't think she can see. She doesn't know what to do, does she? She just wants to be close, like warm. Like she's, a little mouse. Have you felt her pot? Her pot belly? Oh, she's got a proper little pot belly. Oh, wow. <laughs> Time to say goodbye, oh, Fifi. I don't think I'm ready yet. Fifi! <laughs> oh. Gin Geng Ma. Gin Geng. Gin Geng. She eats too much. Ah, she eats too much. She has a little belly. Yeah. Ah. Fat belly. But Poo Pasa Angit, I might have. Little bit. Kun Poo. Ah. How old is she? Oh, two weeks. Two weeks? Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> Okay, Fifi, we go now. Bye bye. We go to oh, Ranong. She just mm -hmm. wants us to go. She's we go to Ranong. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, I know, she's so cute. I know, I know, I know. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. Time to go. We're gonna have to go. <laughs> we need to go to go, oh, go shop. Have you ever seen anything so goddamn cute? No, it's really cute. <laughs> <laughs> I know, she's she doesn't know what to do. Bye bye, okay. Go for cab. Almost we go. Alright then, we've just driven about 20 minutes out of Ranong City. It's a really nice spot for the sunset. Got a really cool little like temple shrine here built into a tree. Then there's a lake. It looks really, really beautiful here. But the reason we've come here is to climb this. Can you see the big, big white staircase? There's the huge staircase at the top of that hill. We should get a cracking sunset view, but while we're here, just check out this little lake. So beautiful, you can see loads of families are going up. Yeah, this should be really nice. 
And it's a beautiful temple grounds as well. And it's a really nice little area here. Right, so at the base of these steps, we've just got a beautiful temple complex. Like, look at this. That is absolutely gorgeous. It's huge. Really ornate. And the backdrop is just stunning. The backdrop, the green jungle, it's just... Wow. That is so, so beautiful. Look at that. Toilet painting. Yeah, that's gorgeous, isn't it? Really gorgeous. But we are going to be heading up here. Let's get a bit closer. Here we are at the base of the steps. I think this is saying there's 343 steps all the way up there. It's not that bad. But yeah, I'm just going to show you this again because it, the views are just incredible. I can't wait to get up and show you from the top. Got this beautiful lake here. Oh, it's well nice. It's so peaceful. So serene. I want to come back and feed these fish. The giant. Alicia's found a cat. Is it pregnant? Pregnant cat. Oh, there's a puppy here. What Hello. Hello. Hey, quite cute, aren't you? Hi. Quite cute. A little bit scared, a little bit skinny. It's nice, isn't it? Oh, sprinklers. Sprinklers are on us. It might be a fairly short staircase. I think, what did it say? 343 steps, but this bit, I don't call this a staircase. I call this a wall. Look how steep it is. It's like vertical. But yeah, the views, the views are going to be worth it up here. I just nail it now. Right, that was actually super easy. I reckon it only took about five minutes. But it was just super steep. Now the views up here are absolutely incredible. We've got these gongs, bells. And essentially we are now on the top of a hill with 360 degree views. So we're going to stay up here until sunset. I'll just show you this. Look at Ranong province. It is stunning. Beautiful temple. Look at those mountains. I think in rainy season there's a waterfall somewhere, maybe over there. Over there is the green hill, which at the minute is as brown as it gets. But in rainy season I'm guessing it will be bright green with like fresh grass. It's called like the green grass hill or something at the signs there. We've got a Buddha on the top. There's absolutely no one here. Like two people. What a place to end the Ranong motorbike mission. Wow. Got all the birds. Let's just have a quick look on the other side. So yeah, we're just on the top of like a mound. It's hot. Just on this side, more jungle. The jungle never ends. Oh no, can actually see the ocean again. And probably Myanmar over there. What do you think, Leish? Beautiful, isn't it? It's so peaceful. It's perfect. The sunset's gonna like, be right there as well. It's gonna be good, isn't it? Puesta de Sol. Puesta de Sol. There we have it, the sun's about to go down. How beautiful is this place? So yeah, over there, somewhere over there is Myanmar, Burma. And on the other side of the ocean over there is like a few Thai islands. So nice, so nice. Just jungle. Really, really nice place. And there was no one here. There's only like four people up here, so it's absolutely stunning. Yes, so this will probably be the end of the Ranong video. Thanks so much for watching. What an amazing province, so underrated.
ridiculously beautiful. We've had a well good day here. Oh wow, they are so big. Oh my word, they are massive. They're like 20 kilos, they're giant. Look at them. These people feeding them, we're getting a free fish shot. Crazy big. Holy moly, they're big. So many of them as well. Oh, poor calf. <laughs> oh, that's so oh. oh, she's going to fish. Oh, wow. Have you seen the size of this fish? There's one of those. Oh, wow. That is, that is such a big fish. Look at his eyes. That's so nice, this family. We just have a little girl to give us lots of this fish food. That's so nice. Look how big they are. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Honestly, that, that fish down there is ridiculous. Well, isn't it? Well, I'll try and get them all here, eh? Oh, I just got splashed. Did you see? You completely splashed me. So cute. I'm getting away from it now, they're proper splashing me. Uh, That's so nice. Oh. Go pong cab. Go pong cab. Oh, I don't know if you can see, there's like absolutely giant, giant catfish there. Wow. All the big bad boys under here hiding like that. Oh, I wish you could see, they're so big. Some of the biggest fish I've ever seen. That was so cute. I was like, what is she doing with that? I know they told her to give you the fish Did I give food. Back this back? Maybe. We just went to give her the cup back and she just instantly just refilled our cup up. This little girl is so cute. Oh, she's going off the edge this time. She just gave us a full refill to feed these fish. so cute. She didn't even think about it. It was just in my cup straight away. 